Happy Vlogmas! Hi everyone, my name is Fajera and welcome to or back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we're going to be talking about DIY gift ideas for this holiday season. One of the things you can create this holiday season is body and lip scrubs. You only need like three or four ingredients for that. A mason jar that you can buy from the dollar store, sugar, honey, or coconut oil. If you're going to use the honey or, or coconut oil, just make sure that there's more sugar than there is honey or coconut oil because we want it to have that body scrub consistency. Just for like scent purposes or aromatherapy purposes, you can add aromatherapy drops. And you're kind of unlimited with how many of these scrubs you make because you can make as little or as much and there's different aromatherapy scents that you can use as well. The next thing that I want to talk about are candles. You can make candles. There are candle kits on Amazon, at Walmart, Hobby Lobby, at Michaels. I also saw one at Five Below, so even better on our pockets, right? Again, with those aromatherapies that you used for the lip or body scrubs, you can use those in your candle. The mug that's being used in this photo, I have one from the dollar store. If you want something like a cute little glass for the candle to go in, the dollar store has really beautiful glassware for that. This next one is a little more heartfelt, having like a themed jar. So for example, in this jar, it's talking about song lyrics that describe how you feel about the person. I like words of affirmation. Anytime I have, I think it's the Yogi tea. Anytime I get one of those tea bags, they have some kind of like affirmation at the end of it. I take them and I put them in here and let's just pull one out. Nature does not hurry, yet everything is accomplished. Those are cool little pick-me-ups that someone can have just in their room that just kind of remind them that you're thinking about them. Amazon, Hobby Lobby, and Michaels have soap making kits. Doesn't have to be expensive, doesn't have to be super difficult either. You could put your essential oils that you use for the body scrubs and for the candle. Maybe put a few pieces of lavender or leaves to make it really aesthetically pleasing. Put mica or glitter in the soap and then it looks really cute in this little box right here. It's a cute little gift for under the tree. Christmas cards are not out of style. Like, we can make Christmas cards. These are probably the most pocket friendly. You just need construction paper or cardstock paper, which, listen, if you don't have cardstock, I understand. I would go to your local printer place and they'll probably sell you a sheet for like less than 20 cents. If you have pens and markers, you can get really creative with the card that you make. You could do a card for songs that remind you of the person, right about a time that inspires you or reminded you of this person. Don't hold out on yourself. There are quite a few ways that you can make a Christmas card super wholesome and heartfelt. You have face highlight that's broken or you just haven't been using it. Add it to some body oil and you can make like a body lava. I know that Target and honestly also the dollar store, they have highlight for really cheap and you can get some body oil and add the highlight to it and it makes the body lava. It's another inexpensive gift that you can create this holiday season. The last thing on my list is for people who know how to crochet. If you don't, I can link some videos down below. I made these sleeves and it took me just a few days to create them. And they're more heartfelt because you made it. Not to mention, I think it took me like a ball and a half of yarn to make this. So two balls of yarn was like six or seven dollars. Makes for a great gift under ten dollars, honestly. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you will create something from this list this holiday season. If you do, Tag me in your photos on Instagram. My social medias are linked down below, so follow me on there to see more of me. If you haven't already, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.